Jank Odo moment. All these things I just said. But here's uh, Misprit. Now, when you talk to it, it has a picture of Misprit. And that'll be enough to fill up your Pokedex for the um, Sinnoh decks to get the National decks and all that. But if you want to catch it, you want to um, just go after it, basically. And it, you could save before you click and show the picture of Misprit if you want to send it into nature. In my opinion, it's just, it's whatever, so I don't mind. Because I'm not going to use Misprit on my team, actually, for the Pokemon League or anything. Quan. And it just flashes away. It's rough somewhere. And surprisingly, Rowan got here. And I don't, I'm pretty sure Rowan doesn't have any Pokemon, so let's just say that he's like Superman or um, Chuck Norris that can walk on water and swim on land. I don't know, but we're getting into a bunch of uh, different opinions, so I'm just gonna, yeah, just talk to him. Steven, that was Misfit, wasn't it? You've accomplished what I asked you to do in the Candlelight Library. I asked you to get data of the Pokemon of the Lake, and you did. But it doesn't didn't provide any answers about the mysterious of the my mysteries of evolution. I still don't know why some Pokemon evolve and others don't. Unfortunately, ultimately, it only depended on it only depended the mystery deepened deepened the mystery. Sorry, but having mis mysteries to solve that adds to my enjoyment. Stephen, why don't you chase after me, Spirit? To me, I seemed as if you wanted to play with you. If you, if you were to use your Pokecatch app, Mark and if you if you were to use the Pokecatch app, Mark and my app, you'd be able to track the movements of the Pokemon. Go on, Steven. I'm sure that you will keep meeting countless Pokemon and people. Those encounters will keep thrilling you in your own special ways. I hope you'll enjoy this that experience. Take care, Steven. How nice, Rowan. How nice. So this has been like five minutes in the video. So I'm gonna explain this quick and then save and then stop this um, part of the video and start like the hunt for Misfit. So yeah, you're outside of that. I'm gonna actually find it on my pocket job. Let's see here. Nope, nope, that's a memo pad. Calculator. Clock. Wink searcher. <laughs> okay, here's the market map. So... Bad's filming on the bottom screen. Here's the market map. If I can get my stylus. Okay. No, I'm using a dart actually. Here's my dart again. The thing I used for Giratina to help me suck Pokeballs because I was up with my fingers and all that. Here's the market map. And here are you, here's where you are right there. That blinking square. As you start to move. You see that blinking dot? Wait, no, there's not a blinking dot there. What am I talking about? Okay, there we go. So. Here's where Misfit is. It's near Celestic Town, but as you switch routes, it will. So you want to like go switching in between routes and cities. I'm going to show you where I, I always like to do it, and that's how I caught Misfit in my Diamond and Pearl. Of course, you didn't get to see that video, but that's where I searched for it. So yeah. Oh yeah, no, that messed up the camera angle. Dang it. The um, cropping and all that. So I mean, I'll do this from the top screen. Okay. This is bad filming. But yeah, as I said, when you switch routes in cities, it will. So it'll jump around all throughout Sinnoh right here. Um, it can't go in this area right here because that's after game stuff. It can't go right here. Well, it can go right here, so you just have to make it teleport to different places. It can go north, it can go west, it can go east, it can go south right down here. Well, actually right down there too, but you want to also just keep it around this area. Or this area right here. So just this whole rectangle or square part, or circle, whatever. So you... Again, we're just going to go on the hunt, and in the next segment of this video, I'll show you how to hunt properly. And you just want to keep an eye out when you switch routes, and if it's like, say it's right here, and you just want to look carefully around the um, area for wild grass or, in wild, or the wild water, or whatever. So that's pretty cool. Um, what else does the guy say? Shoot. Oh, you can only use your bike or run. I think you can only use your bike or running shoes to switch through the routes, because you can't really fly, because it'll just swap places, and if you fly again to a different spot, it'll just swap places again, and you'll never meet up with it. So you just want to go back and forth on your bike. I recommend your bike, okay? So this has been the um, first segment of this video, so I'll see you guys in the next segment, the Misfit Hunt. So wish me luck. Hope you enjoyed this um, part of the video. I'll see you soon. See you on the other side, you guys. Okay, guys, here's segment two, as I explained. Um, just keep your eye on, doubt on the um, touch screen, make sure your market map is viewable, and yeah, keep it on the app. So, again, you want to be on your bike. I'm on Judo Life, uh, I'm in Judo Life City, um, so I'm gonna, okay, now I'm on my bike. But, 
repel off. Okay, when you switch routes, like go into this route right here, and when it sh shows the name right there, yeah, you see, um, you'll see, um, Misfit move, and you, I can't really show this on the bottom screen without moving up my crappy, but I'll just do that right now. So, yeah. So, like, I'm right here, like, I'm just right on the route, and I'll go up to Judo Live City, and you'll, you'll see by, the, you'll hear by the music that the change, the Judo Live music changing, or changing to Judo Live music. So, now we are in, um, Judo Live City again. See, um, and then when you go back to the route, when you go back into the route, it'll move like that. See, like, if you see the marking, the, the blinking marker right there, and if I, I can't film this that great, let, let me do that. Well, it's more full screen almost, too. It's close to it. Going back. See how it just jumps on the bottom screen when you switch routes? You want it to match up to where you are, which, for example, I'm right there. Dang, I can't. I'm stuck at filming on the bottom screen. But that's where I am. So I'm going to try to get Misfit to match up right there. So. Dang, I'm so bad at this. I'm sorry, guys. I apologize. Is that where I am? You misfits actually where I am? Okay. So, now that I got that done, that's a bunch of switching. You wanna look for a gra- Stupid... DS, I don't know. I don't know why it's like that. Dang it. What did I do with my DS? Oh, there we go. This is- I climbed up on my- I'm gonna take a minute to, um, fix up my camera again, so... Again, I'll just make a little jump cut. To, to where it's actually full screen and actually lined up again. Okay, so my screen is now lined up and all that, hopefully. And, and editing, of course. So, I always look for a patch that's always... Don't exit the route when it's like this close to you. But, yeah. Look, I look for a patch of grass that's actually shaking a little bit. But I'm not sure. Let's see here. You have to get the right spot, too. As far as I'm concerned, Misfits are right where I am. So, let's try that. That's not it. I don't recognize the music. Be doof. No. You're not Misfit. You know, we're close to Misfit. I think Misfit actually switches routes after this battle. Let me, let me check on the bottom screen. <sighs> nope, Misfit's still here. Okay, we can just go searching for it. Oh! Also, I forgot this whole thing. You want to put a repel on. That helps a lot. And make sure you have a Pokemon that has... That's under level. F it's under level 50. Shoot! Darkness is not under level 50. That sucks. How am I gonna catch this then? Darkness is not under 50 or below. That's gonna be a problem. Oh, oh, it switched, um, switched routes. Yeah. So keep up with your ma max repels or whatever. I prefer max repels because they last the longer, the longest out of the repels. So good, I'm going to have to do the same thing. I'm going to have to keep my eye on the bottom screen. But I showed you before how to get to it, so. Nope. I repel off, okay. Come on, Misfit. Come to Papa. Misfit, you're coming, you're like chilling in the same area. Okay, you're getting closer. Nope. Okay, it's set in the same place. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep their pearl off so I can try to catch Misfit. But I only get one shot at it, I believe. Okay, there we go. We got it. We got it. Okay, this is Misfit. We got it. So it works out. Misfit's level 50. Thank goodness. Like in Diamond Pearl, it had confusion, but in this game, it has Swift instead, basically. So yeah, I won't have any special attack, uh, super effective moves brought on me. First, you want to use Mean Look. And if you have a Pokemon that has like Arena Trap, like a Diglett or a Shadow Tag, like Wobbuffet, I think you may be able to get Wobbuffet in the main game, but whatever. You want to use um, Mean Look. But if you have a Pokemon that has Arena Trap or um, like a Diglett or a Shadow Tag, like a Wobbuffet, go for it. Because it's already set, you know. But you can't escape. Good thing I'm faster than Mist, but so I'm happy for that. Because it's probably are fast anyway. So we're going to actually use Shadow Ball. I cannot switch out. If I faint, Mist will run away after I send out the next Pokemon. So I have to keep Darkness in battle as long as possible. And this is take one. It takes this long to get to take one. But I'm happy. I found Mist. 
Misfit is awesome, and this is the same method I did when Diamond Apparel when I recorded the video for it. I you get show I get show Misfit off in my channel now. I'm gonna try one more um, Shadow Ball on it, so yeah. Critical hit. I'm gonna heal up just in case, cause I don't want to know a critical hit like that. Um, I really have to be careful too. Move the milk. Let's go. Wow, exactly 100 HP healed up. That's awesome. Exactly. Okay, Miss Brit. Okay, let's do this. I'm still in the same recording session as of this point with um this Aussie legendary Pokemon of the lakes. So that's awesome. Because I'm just, in the same night I've caught Yuxi and Azolf, so why not go for a Misfit too? All in one night in recording at least. That'd be cool. No, my cam, I get bumped it. I'm gonna have to fix that in editing. Dang it! Yes, okay, we got you. We got you, Miss Brit. We got you. So this is take two. I think. Yeah, this is take two. I just had to think there. So let's go, Darkness. Again, we're gonna use a mean look on it. So that's gonna be cool. Yes, okay, we're faster than again. This is why I taught Mean Look to um, Darkness in the first place, and when I did Mean Look for um, Gengar, for this particular reason, to catch Misfit. Because this is like one of the easiest ways to catch Misfit, just use Mean Look on it, that's like, or um, yeah, I think only Mean Look is that way. Yeah. Lucky Chant. Oh, Critical Hits? No! We don't want that. No, at least I don't want that. Okay, I'm gonna use an aerial. That's actually questioning the fact now. I don't. Should I use? Okay, use lower my attack. Why not lower my special attack, please? I don't know. So look, I'm gonna use an aerial race. Hopefully, it won't faint it. But let's see. Good. Okay, I don't want to risk anymore. I don't want to risk hurting it more. Cause I might get a critical hit. So let's just stick with this. It's at least it's in red health at least. So let's use a. Let's use a, um, oh, where's my Ultra Balls? Okay, it's right there. Yeah, because since I ran out, it went low down to my slot for my Pokeballs. That was getting really good. So, yeah, you can use your Master Ball and Misfit if you don't feel like chasing it around and stuff. But this way, it's, it's more fun just chasing it around. Unless it's, like, 3 o'clock in the morning, which is not in my case. It's only, like, it's only, like, 7.30 at night in my case. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, it took me three days to find, um, um, to find, what was it? To find Radios in my Pokemon Ruby slash Sapphire walkthrough the after game. So, three days of searching for this thing. But yeah, this is only the same take two for the um, or the same recording session. Two? Dang it! This is still in the same recording session for Azoth and Yuxi actually. <laughs> it's all good. Okay. Nope, nothing. <laughs> Miss Brick. You happy? I have your two friends on the PC. Why don't you come join them and be a part of my Pokemon walkthrough guide? Well, I already debuted your um, friends in previous parts of this walkthrough guide, but oh, whatever. You can come if you want, but prefer preferably I want you to. And at this point, you have no choice, because I keep on throwing baseball-sized balls at you. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to use my Archball, Miss Louise move, and then I'll probably get hit by the future side attack. One, two, three. Miss Brett, you jerk! Oh, come on, you shake three times. Yep, there we go, it's right with the future side thing. But you shake three times again, and you don't. One, two, three. Yes, I have six, and then I get catch it. Oh, yeah, Miss Brett was caught. Ultra Ball. Yeah. This is gonna be a long video to edit. I mean, Azelf's would take no problem. With it. it wasn't even 10 minutes before I caught it, so. And then Yuxi was in the middle, kinda. But then again, Yuxi took three takes, and Misfit took away two. Okay. When Misfit flew, people learned the joy and sadness of living. The joy and s sadness of living. It was the birth of emotions. Weight, or uh, height, only one foot. Wow, that's like a Subway sandwich, a $5 foot long, yeah, whatever. I'm not advertising for them, I'm just saying. And then 0. 0.7 pounds. I would think that thing's at least 3 or 4 pounds, but okay, it's not even a pound. 
That's awesome. Okay. I will not give a nickname to Miss because I don't nickname legendaries. Yeah. That's so cheap. That right there is cheap. It's cheap. Come on, Bidoof. Just run. Okay, I'm gonna actually fly. Where do we want to fly next? Oh, I know. We can fly back to Pastoria and go to that one route that was blocked off, cause yeah, cause that guy said there was a blackout in Sunshine City, or the route to Sunshine City. So here's Heart Veilstone. So let's go to Pastoria. So yeah, that's nice.